head on over to g2a.com for some sweet deals on video games. Remember to use the promo code Willis for the best prices. g2a.com What is going on guys? Willis Gaming here. We are back with another Destiny 2 video. Good old throwback to the good old days, Destiny 2. We're showing our loot in this video, guys. Uh, just finished the raid, the new Crown of Sorrows raid. Got a bunch of loot to show you. And uh, yeah, if you guys go on to enjoy the video, make sure to leave a like down below. The winner from last video's silver giveaway will be on screen right now. If you'd like to win some silver so you can buy all of those new Season of the Opulence goodies at Eververse, Leave a like on the video, leave a comment down below, and make sure you are subscribed to the channel with bell notifications on if you want to. So, when you guys remember this back in Destiny 1, every single week I would do like my times 3 loot on each character. Like, I think that's like what I started out actually doing videos on in Destiny 1, which is kind of funny. Um, I used to run the, the raid every single week on 3 characters, and then just show like all the loot which I got. Um, I may start doing that again, honestly, because the new raid is actually really, really fun. It's pretty tough as well. It's extremely difficult. Um, but yeah, I guess let's just go over the loot I got. Um, no specific order. I really didn't get that much stuff. I probably got like three, four items in total. But let's take a look at the gun I got, the Emperor's Courtesy. It, it kind of reminds me of the Found Verdict. Tell me this does not look like the Found Verdict. And this is what kind of sparked me to make this video. Like, as soon as I saw this, I just had, like, flashbacks of my, like, Vault of Glass loot videos. And I thought it'd be really cool. So, this is the Emperor's Courtesy. I got it from the last boss. Um, it's got Smoothbore, Corsica Rifling, Pended Mag, Light Mag, Snapshot Sights, and Underdog. Obviously, these can all roll differently. The shader which you get with most of the gear that drops in the raid is called Imperial Opulence. It has a mod slot, so you can slot in a weapon mod, and it rolled with handling. Not too great, probably not the greatest rolls I could have got, but it's one of the new raid weapons, which is pretty cool. Um, another drop I got, which was the Titan Raid Helmet, the Shadows Helm. It rolled with pump action, kinetic weapon targeting, enhanced ashes to assets, sword, and linear fusion, fusion rifle reserves. They also got resilience and restorative mod. Now the cool thing is about uh, this gear, it actually rolls with a armor mod, but you also get an opulence uh, armor mod slot. So these mods you can actually get from doing the Leviathan raid and the Crown of Sorrows, I'm pretty sure. Um, this is the one I actually got as well. This was another drop, the Hive uh, repurposing. Uh, mod which destroying a hive shield refreshes your grenade ability so this was uh, this is actually going to be really good in the uh, last encounter with the wizards when you destroy their shields you actually get a grenade back so that's really really awesome uh, it rolled with solar damage and it uh, I put the callous treasured uh, shader on it um, and then that's pretty much all the loot I got other than probably the best piece of loot I could have got which was the heavy is the crown emblem this is the 24 hour completion emblem so if you finish the raid from launch within 24 hours you are given this emblem the heavy is the crown so I think that's pretty awesome um, I've got the scourge one as well which is cool uh, but yeah, that's been my loot. I know a lot of you are probably going to ask as well what arms I'm using. So I used this in one of my thumbnails. I didn't realize it was a ornament. I thought it was a new exotic. It's the Synthoseps and it's the Flex Enhance uh, ornaments, which are basically just like Siva muscles and the Siva diamond thingies. But yeah, I think that's pretty cool. Uh, but yeah, that's been my loot for the week. Let me know as well, guys. Should I do my times three loot every single week? Because I am down to run it on all three characters. Um, I think it'd be really cool to do. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Drop a like down below and make sure to subscribe to the channel for daily looter shooter videos. This has been Willis Gaming and peace.